Hey, a pleasure. Good day, everybody. This is Sports Tonight News. I'm Jeff Work, and this is going to be a video on a Royals getting another one, two to one, a defensive led win, and a Hayden Hawkey led win, who was the first star of the game, as he made a bunch of key saves in this game. wasn't a very difficult game for him because it wasn't a bunch of A plus scoring changes. The Royals played an A plus defensive game, but when needed, he did make nice saves on blasts from the point and yada yada yada, and also on a breakaway on the one two on one mini two on one there as well so he stepped up when needed he deserved that first start of the game the Royals deserved this win this was a great defensive induced win they struggled against Trois Riviere in November up there in Trois Riviere Trois Riviere is an offensive juggernaut of a team this year second in the league but no dice for them today coming in off of a win both teams in this game looked a little bit um tired at times because both were obviously coming off of a um game that they played yesterday, and then both obviously looked tired a little bit in the second, and the third, TR started pushing shot-wise a little bit, but again, the Reading Royals kept them to the outside, most of those shots were from the outside, and when they were a little bit better, but not in the slot, they really didn't get much opportunity to slot at all, but when they were a little bit closer um, from side shots, uh, it was still a lot of not high-octane scoring chances for the Trois Rivier Lions, and that is a key to success any night, any given night in hockey, and that's a big key to why the Royals won this game. The other reason why the Royals won this game was Hayden Hawkey, like I said earlier, he played a very good game. And the third thing is, um, Trevor Gooch has continued to be amazing for this team since coming back to the Royals, as has uh, Jackson Cressy um, since being uh, in the ECHL in his first season this year, who got another assist on the Braden Low goal, as well as Kenny Hausinger, who made a very nice, beautiful play to the net, finding a way to get himself to the net front, to then be able to draw the puck to then cause a rebound play opportunity for Braden Low, who was crashing, who was then able to pot the goal in, and that was a very, very, very nice play all around, as they were able to get it past uh, Pog, 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 Liar, Pog Liar Rolo. I think is how you say that goaltender's name, Pogler Rulo, um, for the Trois Rivieres. They have some of the toughest names to pronounce in the league. Uh, Eric did a great job today, but I definitely um, have some of the toughest names to pronounce when it comes to that. Archambault was able to get uh, a goal for Trois Rivieres battling in front. It was a battle of like basically all the bodies on the ice in front. It was a very crowded crease. He was able to locate the puck and then get it past Hayden Hawkey. There was really nothing Hawkey could have done. Um, in that situation, uh, Hayden Hawkey continues to have very, very, very good success. Um, Hawkey has five wins on six tries in net, uh, and after losing five to one and nine to one in Trois Rivieres, the Running Royals get revenge in a very good defensive game, which is great to see them win this way because they've been winning in all facets. They're finding ways to win. Yes, they're, they um are, are a team. That obviously, now because of the point percentage things, have moved back in second, but they're going to be right back in first if they keep finding ways to win like this, even uh, with the Newfoundland Garrows having to have games at hand and them playing good as well. The Reading Royals are a team that continuously find ways to win a game, where, of course, the big club that, that they're a part of in the Philadelphia Flyers do the exact opposite. So it's nice to have a team in the organization that continuously, with the Reading Royals, find ways to win games. They won because they played um, a good, again, um, physical game in this, where Brain Lowe was able to have a fight, they had good physicality, they had good shot block, and Cooper, of course, had a key block on the end of um, the game PK there, and they were very good on the PK as well, to be able to limit any offense and any momentum from Trois Riviere, when they had power plays, so key, PK, key overall defense, A-plus grade to defense, A-plus grade to the PK, A-plus grade to Hayden Hawkey, those were the main reasons they won, but Cressy stayed hot, Braden Lowe continues to be a very poised key player for this team, and then Trevor Gooch has continued to be a great re-addition, as of course he was on the team before. Everybody have a great time, a pleasant day, as the Reading Royals' success, they just keep on trucking, keep on rolling, and keep on staying hot, as of course they win 2-1 to one in a defensive tilt against the Trois Rivieres Lions. Peace out everybody, stay safe as I would say the stars of the game in this one are Jackson Kretschy, Trevor Gooch, and of course Hayden Hawkey. Please continue to subscribe down below or up above on the easy-to-use widget. Excuse me, let's go Royals. Let's keep the winning ways going tomorrow.